Now we'll start uh, the LACNIC technical, technical Forum, and let me invite Carlos Martinez, um, LACNIC Technology Manager, who will uh, give you the welcome, uh, uh, who will give the welcome address to LACNIC FDL. So, thank you, Sandra. Welcome. It's really quite a, a moving moment, and it's a pleasure to have you again. I'm going to give you a brief introduction uh, to tell you what the LACNIC uh, Technical Forum is all about. Well, I had some slides, but actually it was not too necessary to, well, LACNIC, the LACNIC Te Technical Forum is a, a space for exchange. We are going to have some demos. And in the end, we are going to share information on new technologies, new techniques, and things that have uh, an impact on our lives as uh, network operators. This is the uh, part of the program where we give shorter presentations, but uh, we uh, give the floor to more presenters to bring uh, contents of uh, technical interest. So this will be the fifth uh, uh, LACNIC Technical Forum. Two of them were in person, one in uh, Panama, another one in Punta Cana, and uh, two online editions, virtual editions. So we have the uh, definition, uh, and we want to attract new uh, topics, and uh, we we don't want to stick to the most uh, common topics and bring new topics and uh, bring new people to to give them a possibility to present uh, their topics. The the structure of the uh, LACNIC Technical Forum is a bit different from the rest of the technical um, events. Uh, we have a programs committee with two representatives of the community, Wanda Perez and Jorge Villa. Jorge is there. I think that you all know Jorge, quite famous in the community. And several members of the staff, including myself, Mariela Rocha, Guillermo Sicileo, and Ernesto Majo. How we don't evaluate uh, the papers ourselves, but to pool of voluntary um, evaluators who, based on their expertise, they offer to um, select. Uh, the, and uh, this is dynamic, and we select it based on what we see. <clears throat> Precisely, I want to thank the evaluators who um, uh, used their time, uh, devoted their time uh, to assess this. Well, you know that we all like uh, the numbers. There's a strong representation by Argentina and uh, many evaluators from Argentina. I won't mention them all because there are 30, but I want to thank them all because without them, it wouldn't have been possible to have a broad, such a broad tool of experts. So the first activity today will be our keynote speaker by Lee Howard, who's ready. It's called, uh, his presentation is called Influences on IPv6 Deployment. And then we're going to have IPv6, routing, the Internet of Things, and security topics. And last but not least, a presentation that we'll have, I think that this one is for, for, Friday, for Thursday, about the opportunities uh, for projects, uh, grants uh, through the FRIDA program. So uh, that was all uh, for me.